Hi, beauties and curls. It is crazy. We are going through our trash. We are doing some trash talking today. Oh, from the picture, I know you saw that I have a lot of empties. I do have a goal. Y'all know our project pan. I have a goal to get through 250. I've raised the stakes. I said 100, but this looks like a lot from January and February. This looks like a lot of beauty products and I'm probably close to 100. So I'm raising the stakes to 250 beauty products, including hair, body, makeup, skincare, beauty products, y'all. I want to get through 250 for the year. I just feel like it helps me with the goal of really giving you guys star reviews and really just thinking about what products I love and I don't and going through those and like slowing down on my purchases and really just like already using what I have in front of me. So that is the goal. Let me just say, if you are new to this channel, welcome. If you hadn't subscribed, go ahead and hit the subscribe button and also that bell because it's going to notify you whenever I upload. So let's just jump right in because we got to do some trash talking. Okay. I am, y'all, these are probably the most sad things that I am getting rid of. This is the buffing brush by Real Techniques. The bristle started to come out. So yeah, this I'm letting go. I'm actually gonna get another one and Beauty Blender all day long. I This is probably maybe about two years old. I'm going to start getting the black ones. I feel like those last a lot longer and they don't get as dirty as these do, but so sad. I actually dread getting rid of a beauty blender. Does anybody feel me? Okay, this is the Jaden Moon Citrus Rose Body Whipped Body Butter. I love this. This is like my favorite from this company, but I don't think she makes it anymore. So I gotta find another scent. Um, I think she has something called Seduction that I really like, but this smelled so good. It was like the best fusion between flower and fresh or citrusy. Citrus Rose, oh my goodness, that was so good. This Julep Love Your Bare Face Hydrating Cleansing Oil. Oh, no, 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 no. This um, did nothing for me. As a matter of fact, it kind of like made me go blind for a couple of seconds. I had to pray my sight to come back. <laughs> so that is not a repurchase for me. And it's a cleansing oil. No. This is a deluxe size of the Smooth Naturals, the moisturizer. This is really good. I'm going to come with some skincare from Smooth Naturals, but this is really good for your skin and leaves my skin very supple and soft. Okay, so let's talk about some girl things. Okay, this is the Aloe Love Cleansing Cloths for Sensitive Skin by Summer's Eve. This is the only thing that I get from Summer's Eve. I need some refresher wipes, you know, for for the freshness okay these are exclusive to target by the way so yeah if you want to know this is a no for me this is the hydrating mask island escape edition by hello hair oh no this was like this tangled retangled untangled detangled then retangled my hair again that's a, n a no way no these are the bioderma micellar water cleansing wipes i love these repurchase no because the simple facial cleansing wipes the micellar water ones these are just as good and these are my favorite wipes currently from the drugstore and and also the up and up these are really really good so these are actually my two favorite and these you can both get from target make sure you get the ones that say comparable to the neutrogena makeup remover wipes so so because they have ones that are comparable to the ponds too but those no bueno these are from pacifica these are the makeup remover wipes from pacifica no 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 pacifica you got some really good the probiotic like uh, moisturizer oh yes but that no 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 this is the enzymatic uh, exfoliating wipes now these are good this one is really good now the makeup remover wipes no but exfoliating wipes yes Pixie by Petra Milky Hydrating Milky Mist is amazing. I'm going to come and talk about this. I already have a backup. It's a repurchase for me. The Chocolate Wonder Hair and Body Oil. I like this 
until it started really, this is a, it really, it's a massage oil. It's a warming oil too. And it smells like chocolate. Um, I really do like this in the fall and winter. So I can't say I won't repurchase this. It just doesn't call my name right now just because it's spring and summer. So I will probably be repurchasing that, but in the fall and winter because chocolate smells warm to me. And yeah, that is, it's a warming product too, so. This is Escada Born in Paradise. This smells so good. This is more of a spring and summer scent by Scentbird. I really did love this. And I tend to go out of these a lot quicker than my whole bottles. So I love Scentbird for that fact. So yeah. Okay, so this is the Kaylin Dissolvent. This is really, really good. This reminds me of my 3-in-1 Melting Cleanser. Um, by Oleg Henderson. So I really do like this, but I won't be repurchasing it just because I need something else. If I find something else from Kaylin that I really like, I will repurchase that. But it's a really good product if you love. That's Korean skincare, so I really did like that. Okay, so I have some more mascaras. This is the Motives by Lala. I really did enjoy this, and this is a natural bristle. Yeah, it and it's a thick consistency i really did enjoy this mascara so repurchase from motives i need to see how much this was but mascara i tend to spend a little bit more money but i there are some motives products so i will repurchase this the mark jacobs this is the omega lash i really did enjoy this too and this is a natural br bristle brush i can a lot of times tell by the bristle sometimes because it's it's a combination between the bristle and the formula when it comes to picking a really good mascara and Marc Jacobs makes some good mascara so yes this would be a repurchase for me but I did get that from a I got that from a point box from a Sephora so yeah I'll repurchase that this is the MAC Studio Fix Fluid in NC44 this will be a repurchase for me this just got really old and I'm just gonna take this back to MAC and yeah when it smells like kind of crazy, don't put that on your face. You will pay for it, okay? So yes, this is a repurchase for me. Oh, this is a Sorenzo, uh, Sorenzo Bath and Body. This was the Berry Vanilla. It started smelling weird, but it was because of me. Not because it's not a good product because I'm actually going to purchase it again, but you have to use it up because it contains, it's from with natural oils and everything and oils actually stay on longer. Whenever I use those, I get so many compliments in terms of my fragrance, especially when I layer. Um, this is Mary Kay. This is the Time Wise Replenishing Serum C. I don't really see a difference when I use this. I've heard that you do, but I don't know. Maybe I'm using it wrong. Tell me if I am. This is the Origin Ginseng Refreshing Eye Cream. This is one of my favorite eye creams from, oh my goodness. It just got a little old. I have a little bit in there, but it was because it's old. And when, I'm gonna tell you, when it gets old, it gets patchy. It's supposed to be more of a gel consistency and this got old, but this is an amazing eye cream. If you have dark circles and you have puffy eyes, that is the eye cream for you. This is a Laneige um, Water Sleeping Mask. This is a travel size. I said I was going to keep this because when I travel, I do need to put some of my water sleeping mask in here just because I can sleep in this. I love this because this is a mask that I can sleep in. So I am going to keep this container because this is a repurchase and I already have a backup. I can't say that. Current, 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 I think. Um, it's just so small on here. This is a repurchase. I love Bite Beauty. I have fallen in love with them. So that's a repurchase for me. This is the NYX Control Freak. This is a, a clear brow gel. This was really good. Um, you have to use it in a good a good amount of time, otherwise it will dry out on you. The Time Wise Targeted Eye, um, Eye Revitalizer. This one, I feel like it does something, but I don't know. So I don't know if I repurchase it. I do have a backup of that. I'll have to pay more attention, but I ran out of that one. So obviously it must have done something. The Dr. Brandt Microdermabrasion Exfoliant Skin. Skin Exfoliant. I really did enjoy this. I actually got this in a boxy charm, the full size. So I'm really excited about that because this one, that one was really good. And I love doing micro, microdermabrasions on my skin. 
This is the NYX Time and Frame. This is really good, but it dries out so quick. So I have the Doraline and also the Aqua with the Makeup Forever one. Um, I have the Inglot and the Makeup Forever, like the little drops. This, I feel like it is not going to save this. So I'll just buy another one. This, y'all know this is the OG for me and I ran out of this. This is the NYX Dark Circle Corrector Concealer and I love this. And I, oh, I have the shade DCC03 because they do have different shades. So this is the peach one. That's the 03. This is the Laura Mercier Flawless Face Polish, a deluxe size. I love this. And it, would I repurchase it? No, because I have some other face polishes. And I feel like there's a good DIY face polish that you can do that I think you get the same results and not break the bank. I'm just saying. Maybe I'll come with that video. This is Ziaja. This is a natural like green company if you are into like non-toxic like 100% pure. This is the natural olive oil micellia water for normal to dry skin. This was good. I got this from Ipsy some kind of way but um, it has 1.7 ounces. I like this. I'm gonna look into that. This is the Day Solution by Mary Kay. I love this. C serum i told you about that it's probably a toss but this is a floss i love it. oh the milani runway lash lashes this is a instant volume mascara this reminds me a lot of the l'oreal voluminous carbon black i really didn't like this um i will repurchase this um i really did like this a lot it's very wet so you have to wait until it dries out a bit the dewy finish i have bought like this is maybe like my third or fourth of this. This is amazing. This is a great dewy mist. Oh, ooh, I had a little bit more in there. It's a blouse. I love this stuff. It reminds me of Fix Plus, but without the price, but I'm still gonna buy for like Fix Plus because I love the nozzle and the misting and everything. But NYX Dewy Skin, it's great and it's affordable. This is the sugar butter polish by smooth naturals this is a repurchase for me it really tanned to me if i felt like it tans the skin and polishes it and get leaves it very moisturized where you don't even have to use lotion outside of the shower when you use this this is the be enigma this dried out on me i wanted to try this because tati westbrook on youtube talks about this all the time and i felt like it dried out on me. I got that from an Ipsy Glam bag and it dried out. It was dried out as soon as it came, as a matter of fact, because I was trying to use it. And I don't think it's supposed to, like, it was like very, like a butter, like me spreading butter on my face and very, no, it wasn't right. I don't think it was right. Okay, we're down to the last ones, y'all. Okay, the hydrating serum by uh, first Aid Beauty, I really did like that. That's a repurchase for me. The uh, YSL Black Opium, this is holy grail for me. I love this scent. It is so sensual, so beautiful. I wish it had some more sprays in here, but it's absolutely gone. Ooh. But it's a repurchase. And this is the Nivea Double Action Balm. I really, really, really like this, but guess what? This is not so good for your skin. Uh, the Navy Ash Pulse Shade Balm. Okay, it's okay. It unclocks pores. This is very moisturizing, but I found some stuff that is very, it's better for my skin. And just to have a primer, no, I'm going to toss this because I just feel like mm, I could keep it, but I have so many other primers that I love. So I'm just going to use this on my husband when his beard and his neck and stuff is kind of dry because this is very very moisturizing it has shea butter in it so it's amazing but i have so many other primers that i wanted to use and i decluttered it so yeah so those are my all of my freaking crazy empties for february i'm actually gonna i think raise the stakes and say i want to get rid of I want to use up 250 beauty products this year I'm giving myself a goal because I feel like because I'm competitive with myself I tend to reach goals when I set them so this was a lot I want to say this is close to 100 that's why I'm raising the stakes to 250 but I want to see how many um beauty products that I can get 
uh, through. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up for more empties. I know this was a long one, but yeah. I know we just did some trash talking today. That's all. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe if you hadn't already. And I'll see beautiful you in the next video. Bye, loveys.